Buckham County Schools has paid accounts for teachers grades 6 through 12 and students grades 6 through 12 to use GoFormative. To get started, you'll simply go to goformative.com. There are no spaces. Goformative as one word, dot com. You'll click login in the top right. You can log in with Google or you can type in your email address. Your BCS email address is what associates you with a paid account. If you have trouble logging in, please contact your digital learning facilitator. Once logged in, you can click on Classes. Under Classes, you should see your PowerSchool or Clever Synced classes. You can edit these classes or you can come to the Clever Roster Sync and resync them if you don't see current students. In the library, you can filter for Buncombe County Teachers Formatives. You could also add your school if you see a school group. Or you can take off those filters and simply search for a topic. Once you find a topic and a formative that you think you might use, over to the right, you can click on go to your new formative or add the formative. So I've already added this poetry one. Let me look at another one. So now you can see this one I haven't added to my formatives, so I'm gonna add that to my list. Once I've added a formative that I like to my list, I can go back to formatives this is a grid that shows me all of the formatives that I've used and which classes that I've assigned them to. Once I have my new formative, I can click on that to open, edit, and assign, and view responses. If I want to edit, I can go to the right. I can delete questions that I don't want. I can change the type of question. And I can add content, such as images. There are extra videos included in the series on the BCS Digital Learning YouTube channel that will show you how to edit some of the features in Formative. Once you have the Formative customized, you can click Assign, and you should see a list of your classes that you can click to assign this Formative to. As a student, students will also go to Go Formative. They'll click sign in or log in. They'll use their BCS email. In the top right, students can see messages that have been sent to them or a drop down list that will show them their classes. Or they can scroll through and look at formatives they've submitted or formatives waiting for them to complete. If you have any questions on getting started using Formative, please contact your digital learning facilitator.